All right, your next comedian might actually be from Texas, Montgomery Wayne. Thank you, Mr. Builder. Give it up to Kath, y'all. Funny young lady, man. Hey, man, y'all lost here tonight? Narcs, man. Hey, I came up with some blue humor, man, but this being a classy joint, I don't know if I can say dick and pussy 40 or 50 times in the next three or four minutes. So, uh, came up with some uh, substitutions. Uh, instead of dick, we're going to say uh, extra large tall boy. How's that sound to y'all? <laughs> instead of pussy, we're going to say koozie. Everybody loves koozie, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, raise your hand if you've got an extra large tall boy. Slim pickings, ladies. <laughs> hey, I got size 13 feet, big hands, man. Great. Hey, raise your hand if you got a koozie. Oh, I see one. I bet you got a cute koozie over there. <laughs> you know, people think it's great having an extra large tall boy. And it is, you know, I admit it's pretty cool. But uh, there are some drawbacks, y'all. One of the biggest is tight little koozie. <laughs> you think that'd be the best, man. But if you're lucky enough to fit that tall boy in there, he's just going to squirt right out. <laughs> and chances are, it's going to be the moment of intimacy, y'all. <laughs> we don't need that, you know. So if you got an extra large tall boy, that's because we're looking for a big, tight koozie, man. <laughs> that's marriage material. <laughs> but more often than not, you got to settle for a little, less koo little loose koozie. And then, you know, if times are hard, you got to go with big, loose koozie. That's just messy, y'all. <laughs> and having an extra large tall boy, I don't worry about too much. But I do wonder if that koozie's loose. Where is she getting her beer at, man? I guess she likes those 40 ounces, man. My buddy, his old lady, she's always complaining that his tall boy is not large enough. And uh, that reminds me of Confucius, that old Chinese fella. And Confucius say, woman who complain about extra large tall boy not being large enough may be in need of smaller koozie. <laughs> yeah? All right. <laughs> yeah, uh, some fellas, man, they're with a different koozie every night, man. Thousands of different koozies, y'all. But me, I've been the inclination, I, uh, I've been the same koozie for 20 years, man. 20 years. That's why some of y'all have been breathing. What's the age on here? You got to be 21 to get in? I don't know. But, uh, you know, um, I know how to keep my koozie happy, man. I can keep my koozie with just these two hangovers right here, man. <laughs> <laughs> hey, all you fellas that like those thousands of koozies, man, let me tell y'all something. Y'all need a beer condom, man. One of those brown paper bags. <laughs> you know. Uh, there's enough litter in the world, man. We don't need a bunch of little tin cans running around that aren't wanted, you know? <laughs> hey, y'all, have I talked about love with y'all? Have I talked about love? I know all about love, y'all. Big part of love is a uh, cozy to can compatibility, y'all. You know, if you ain't got that, chances are you ain't got love, man. Hey, uh, you know, uh, I ain't been watching football since I've been doing this comedy, y'all. But uh, I do still watch the cheerleaders, y'all. <laughs> And, uh, you know, I was thinking, man, this place is pretty dull. All these comedy clubs this week have been kind of slow. I guess it's just the winter, fall weather coming in. So I was just going to be a cheerleader, y'all. And so uh, let's see if we can get this going. I just thought of this on the way up here. Give me a C. C. Give me an A. A. Give me a P. P. Give me another C. C. Give me an I. I. Give me a T. T. Give me a Y. Y. What's that spell? Really? That's lame. What's that spell? F-C. What's that spell? F-C. I'm with Henry Wayne. Where my all's at? Right here. Fucking narcs. Everywhere. <laughs> 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 all right, guys.